Hello and welcome to the long view. I'm John Jordan. Today we're doing a first play of Tekken. So there's been some uh, card Tekken games before, card based Tekken games. This is the first kind of beat em up. It's a beat em up with card elements. Um, currently in soft launch testing in Canada. So I've been playing it just a tiny amount. So um, I've done the first mission. This is the uh, second mission. Um, so we can see um, I've unlocked a few characters. You take three characters in your roster. This is my kind of a highest level character. Obviously there's a kind of rarity kind of element. In terms of doing this fighting, it's pretty simple in terms of touch screen. You kind of move backwards and forwards. You block by holding down with your left and you um, do weak attacks, tapping on the right, and then you, you hold down for strong attacks on the right. And then you see these cards at the bottom, which are kind of your power-ups. And if you you basically supposed to get those um, and use them as combos. That's kind of how you uh, how you win. So a bit like um, Kabam's uh, Marvel contest con contest of champions, um, and then they did the uh, Transformer game as well. So kind of a, a lightweight kind of beat 'em up um, control system for a touch screen. Actually, it's even lighter than um, uh, the Marvel game because um, it has these these I guess these this card system as well. Um, which I guess adds this kind of extra gameplay. So we're going through now. You can see there was a branching element there. Um, let's go and play with Nina, even though she's not such a powerful character. As you say, I have got a bit of pasting from Paul there, so my um, health is actually quite low. You can heal, obviously. So here's Nina. You can kind of see where I tap tap on the screen. You can, you can see like a little kind of um, the circle kind of shit appears to show you what I'm doing. So I'm just trying to get the hang of this. I'm, to be honest, not great at Tekken, as in the real Tekken on on consoles. Um, and not, not very good I think at this one either on on touch screen but there we go <clears throat> so um in off, when you start these kind of games you have to get the hang really as well as you can see I played my card there it was too far away from the opponent so that was a bit of a waste you can see the cards um recharge over time um now I should win these fairly easily because it's kind of at the start of the game and again animation is quite fast quite nice not the best looking game ever um, I don't think but um but the animation is fast which is what you care about there we go got a, got a KO I win. And it, it being taken, they have these slightly cheesy kind of a intro and outro lines. <laughs> Bonkers, but there it's kind of the Tekken thing, isn't it? Okay, so you can see I'm kind of working my way through this map. Um, I have to fight off a certain number of, um, I have to beat a certain number of characters to get to the boss. Let's choose another character, one of my three. Um, this is obviously a generic kind of a enemy I'm fighting. Obviously, the different characters have their different styles, different Tekken styles. I've walked straight into that, didn't I? Um, let's see if I can do any better. There we go. There we go. That was a good use of my uh, power-up card. So, doing a bit better now. See, I'm tapping away. She's, she's blocking. She's going to do, trying to do a power attack. I'm trying to run away. She's blocking. I need to do a bigger attack than that. There we go. Oh, and she got me back. Um, so, not, <laughs> not doing too well. Let's use some of these cards, shall we? There we go. And get a bit closer. Ooh, looking like it might be a bit tight. I'm going to parrot in the background. Come on. She's blocking, she's blocking. She's going to let me win, is she? I don't know, maybe she will. Here she comes. There we go. No, uh, <laughs> she wasn't quite sure what she was doing then. If she was knocked out or not. Okay. So when you win, you get coins. There's obviously this kind of root, um, coin... Uh, resource system. So you see here I'm taking one uh, path through. Again, this is very much reminiscent of uh, Marvel Contest of Champions where you had different branching points through and you had to go back and replay levels. So here's a health. Um, I can heal. Um, I've got a few of these that I've kind of uh, been given as I've unlocked crates. So I'm going to use those and level up so I can make it through. So she's back to uh, full health. I'm going to fight Steve. Okay. Oh, good one. So obviously she's more of a uh, acrobatic type character. Ooh, that wasn't nice. There's three combos. There we go. So you can see how that using those cards at the right point do the business. It's kind of hilarious when they fall over and they kind of like then kind of like arch up again, like they've really hurt their back. <laughs> it's just like you've had your face kicked in. Okay, uh, branching again there, we've got some looking like some, uh, that's a strike force isn't it? Um, 
Generic baddies. Round one. Fight. A fourth strike even. Get it right. There we go. So he's a bit Obviously the enemies get harder as you get on. Oh that was a good good one. Too far away on that one. Uh, give and take. So as you can see it's not I don't think Tekken um fans will be too impressed particularly by it. But this is a different kind of game. It's a free-to-play mobile game on a touch screen, so you have to kind of ex accept some sort of you know, differential in the gameplay. Okay, and then we got to the end, so we can fight, fight Panda. Get ready for the next you can see there's different... Um, he's only a one-star Panda, and his health is low, so... Um, should win. But obviously my health's been, been hit by the uh, previous battle. Oh, dear. So let's get some of those cards going. There we go. Let's even things up a little bit. Oh, he's going to do his big attack. I need to get out of the way. Yeah. I need to probably be getting out of the way a little bit better than that. Oh, dear. Yeah, there we go. It's going to... Oh, I should be finishing it. No. Oh, okay. So we both got knocked out. Um, but I think I will be the winner there. Yeah. Okay. So it's a little bit lucky. So rewards and leveling and... Oh, a one-star panda fragment. So... The free-to-play kind of meta game with Tekken is you, um, as, as you do in many of these games now, it's kind of card-based, so you need um, a certain number of shards to unlock the cards. So I've got one of the ten that I need. Um, that's my reward summary. You can see uh, 67% of I explored that level because there's those branching elements that I didn't um, check out. Um, there's different kind of things. This is going back to the main screen now. Um, check out my fighters. So you can see, um, so she was KO'd, so she's got to recharge now. That'll take 29 minutes, 20 seconds. We can see the other characters I used are, are healing as well. Um, I can level up Nina, so I got some of those water frag fragments. I've got a fragment. Oh, I've got a fragment of her as well that um, I don't need because I've already unlocked her. So that'll I'll get something other reward. Oh, okay, so I've got a. That's uh, okay. We're going to go into this bit, aren't we? Mm. So a Waza card, so I can go into her. Each character has skills and a deck, so I can go and um, choose different moves. Obviously, you only have a fixed number of cards in the deck, and you can—I um, assume you can level up these cards. I'm not quite sure. I assume you'll be able to. But you can see how long it takes to um, the power of the card and how long it takes for it to kind of reset. So you can fiddle around with that. Yeah, I don't know if that'll make much difference. <laughs> Slightly quicker recharge. Um, uh, okay, so there we go. Uh, can level up, level her up. You can see she's just a one-star character, so kind of the lowest-level character. Here's a skill system, so I can increase all tap damage by 0.4%. So this being a free-to-play game with requiring a lot of meta, you're not having a massive big Im impact. 0.4% is not a lot, but this is kind of how these how these meta um, systems work. You don't you make very small changes. You make lots of them over time. So you can see here, it's quite a, will be quite a complex skill system over time that I can I can do and there we go we can see all these other characters so there's the one the one shard of the panda that I have I need another nine Paul I've got one shard of him as well um, back to the main screen okay so uh, what have I unlocked here dojo so this is a chest reward system okay so this is like the PvP I, I, I think So you need a PvP element, so I can attack another dojo, or I can set my defenders. Okay, well that kind of makes sense, doesn't it? So it's just another um, way you've obviously got the the single player level that we've just shown. Um, this is a way of having PvP. I would uh, very much doubt you're playing um, synchronously, so this will be um, you'll be basically playing someone else's characters, but using the, they'll have kind of an AI AI gameplay, so you're not actually fighting anyone directly, at least at the moment. I mean that's typically what we what we see in all these mobile games, because um, that's just a sensible way of doing it. And you set up your defense team as well. Um, and you earn keys. Okay, well that kind of makes sense. Um, go back, so we've got the story, we've got events as well, and Dojo, they're the, they're the three modes we have. Yeah, so there we are, Tekken. Um, as I say, uh, Tekken fans, what will they think of it? I don't know if, be, if they're very focused on the gameplay. Um, 
and they might be a bit disappointed um, for someone like me who's not a massive Tekken fan on, or any or beat 'em up fan on console. This is kind of a, this is a deep enough level um, for me to do a beat 'em up. I played quite a lot of uh, Marvel Contest of Champions and actually and actually quite like that as well. So I think this this can appeal. Obviously, that's a pretty successful game, than 100 million dollars of revenue. So um, that's a good model to follow in a way. I guess it being Tekken, they can uh, Bando Namco can generate a lot of um, downloads. Uh, here's a pack system, so I've got this gold. Um, I'm going to unlock this pack, 90,000. So it's soft currency, though, so it's not not particularly um, expensive. So I've got healing. Um, I got some currency, earth shards. I got uh, two Bruce shards. Oh, I got two more Bruce shards, and I got a common fighter. So this will be one that I've just unlocked. So I've got another version of of her, um, which I don't need because I've got a kind of a more powerful version of her. So it's doing all the free-to-play stuff. Um, that we expect, and the gameplay is there. Uh, so I'll definitely be playing some more of Tekken, which I say is currently in soft launch in Canada. So you can check it out if you've got a Canadian App Store account. Other than that, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel so you get more videos as we get further into the game. This is what we do in the uh, in the long view. We play free to play mobile games and make videos um, about things we like. Sometimes things we don't like. As you can see below, follow us on Twitter. Uh, check us out on Patreon um, at the Long View, Long Spelt Double O. Uh, but thanks for watching the video, and hope to see you again soon. Hello, and thanks for watching to the very end of the video. If you have any comments, please put them in the comments box. We love to read your comments. And if you haven't subscribed already, the subscribe button is below. And don't forget to check out some of our other videos. There's two really good examples on the screen right now.